What's up YouTube, Mike here from Techno GI, and today I wanted to answer some questions that I've been getting in the comments about my uh, Windows 10 OneNote issues. And a lot of you guys have been curious, because you haven't upgraded yet, if the issues with OneNote have been fixed. And unfortunately, the answer is absolutely not. Um, like I said, Windows 10 has been out for over a month now. Uh, they pushed out about three pretty large updates to Windows 10, uh, but unfortunately the issues with OneNote and the Surface are still not resolved. So it's kind of a bummer. Like I said, I actually did a trouble ticket with um, Microsoft and they never got back with me or responded to me on it, but I can tell you I tested every day with my OneNote, or I say my Surface Pen, where I hit it and no matter what my settings say, it still brings up the Metro app which I personally hate. Um, so essentially it just, you know, I have to open the desktop app manually instead of using the shortcut on the pen. Not necessarily a big deal, but kind of annoying. And the second issue I had was when I double tap this to do a screen capture, it would, you know, it automatically exports it to the Metro version instead of the desktop version, which I hate because that really is the feature I use the most especially when I'm doing research for my videos or anything else. I like to just clip it and send it to desktop OneNote and from there uh, use it as I need to. But again, those have not been resolved. Um, there's a couple little workarounds you can do. Um, you just add more steps. For instance, uh, if you like to do the screen capture, you just open your desktop OneNote normally. And of course you get the little snipping tool uh, or send to OneNote box that opens by default. And from there, I, I, I essentially just use that and it'll send it to where I want in the desktop app instead of using the pin action. So hopefully Microsoft will get off their butt and fix this issue because I know based on the forums, I am definitely not the only one who um, wants this to be fixed and who use uh, those features in OneNote religiously. So um, I'm gonna keep um, checking daily to see if it's fixed and look at the various updates and when they do fix this I'll definitely post a video letting you guys know because I know a lot of you guys this is one of the reasons you have not upgraded to Windows 10 because you're waiting for this to be fixed so I'll definitely post an update so thanks for watching and thanks for the comments uh, like I said I do read all my comments so if you got questions you want me to look at something for you on Windows 10 uh, feel free to shoot me a comment and I'll do it so as always uh, if you like this video give it a thumbs up if not give it a thumbs down and uh, as always, if you've not subscribed, please hit that red button. Thanks.